What's going on, y'all? Hey, all right, now, I've done a video, a short, on uh, Pay Lakes. All right, this is to answer a whole lot of people's questions. That When I said it's inhumane and all this and that, so don't swipe. Watch this all the way through because I'm getting ready to drop some very valuable information for y'all, and all of this can be Googled. It is illegal to transport fish from one body of water to another body of water and release them. That is illegal. Google it. Look it up. So, that being said, you're going to go fish a tournament at a pay lake. Um, there's 30, 40, 50 pound catfish in this pay lake. How did they get there? I'll give you a minute. Oh, and there's no hatchery you can go buy this fish from. So, how did that 30 pound catfish get in that pay lake? How did it get there? It was illegally transported from one body of water and released into that. So now it's an illegal fish in your back, in that pond that you're fishing, this tournament, this pay lake that you're fishing for this fish. You're fishing for an illegal fish. Wh whoever transported that fish done an illegal activity. They transported that fish from hypothetically, let's say, went down to the Dan River, caught a 30-pound blue, transported it, moved it up to this pay lake, and released it. They committed an illegal activity. It's a hell of a fine. It's also possible jail time. Now, you are paying that person that owns that pay lake to go fish that tournament or whatever, to go catch that illegal fish that he has in his body of water, now you're paying to go try to catch that fish, which will be caught, then throw back in that body of water for that person to have another tournament, which he makes money off of. This illegal fish, it's in his body of water. He's making money off of it. it then you win money when you fish your tournament. If you win, you win money. Then you throw that fish right back in that body of water again to repeatedly keep being caught over and over and over. It's the same as dog fighting, same as chicken fighting. The only difference is, is it's pay lakes they ain't made them illegal yet. That's the only difference. They just ain't made them illegal yet. But they will. One day. It's going to happen. Because it's inhumane. The same fish being caught over repeatedly, repeatedly, repeatedly. How is that not inhumane? It would be like me taking and locking you in a cell. Bringing you out. Let you fight. Then putting you right back in the cell. Then bringing you out. Let you fight. Then put you right back in the cell. It's the same as dropping a dog over in a pit. Letting it fight. Bringing him out. Putting him back in the pit. Letting him fight. Same as chickens. It's the same thing. You keep catching the same fish over and over and over and over and over. Learn how to go to... And people say, oh, there's no ponds. There are ponds, rivers, lakes, creeks, and streams in every county, in every city, in every state across the, across the U.S. Fish them if you want to. That's on you. I mean, personally, I don't because it's an illegal. I, I'm I'm trying to catch an illegal fish. I mean, that fish that's in that body of water is in that body of water illegally. Bottom line, I mean, I've had Pay Laker guys contact me and say, Mike, 50 cent on a pound to catch, go catch. No. <laughs> One, no. It's an illegal. It's illegal to do to go catch that fish and transport it and put it in that body of water so that Pay Lake has illegal fish in it. Bought it. Hats off to y'all. Y'all have a good rest of y'all's day.